It's mark it up big time. Let's get straight into it. Do not place a trade based on what you're seeing in this video today because trading is risky and it can cause substantial financial loss. There are so many areas you need to become good at to become a good trader. Emotional mastery, chart reading, trading systems, money and trade management. So this video is just educational only to help you become a much better trader. Hey traders, I've just recorded the video walking you through the top success mindset trading techniques to really help you move forward. You know that most of your trading success comes from your mindset. So click on the button above that says success mindset to get access to this video right now. All right, hey traders, market update time. Let's get straight into it. All right, hey traders, as I've been saying to you before for many times during the probably the last few weeks of this market, of the Dow Jones, of the S&P 500, and so on and so forth, that the buyers are still in control when we look at the peaks and troughs, right? And we can still see here, look at this, look at this, bam, trough, buyers in control, bam, trough, buyers in control. We possibly were looking for maybe a possible lower peak here, but we're waiting for confirmation. We didn't get that, right? We popped up. When we popped up, I did a video this day here saying, buyers still are in control. Do not be, do, do not be, do not be calling stock market crash. The people who call a stock market crash are continue to be wrong and wrong and wrong because no one knows when the market's going to crash, if it's going to crash, right? But look at this here. Look at this another update here. We've got like another small little, uh, again, this doesn't mean it's going to keep going up, but look at this here. The market the market is telling you, right? Look at the peaks and troughs. But buyers in control, buyers in control. And, and now look at the thing, the thing is now had a little pullback, had a nice update with good volume. This thing looks like it's getting ready to have another good run to the high side. Bam, out of there. So, uh, and, and I'm actually long, I, guess I got, what's that, two, two or three financial stocks in my portfolio right now that I'm actually bullish on. I've got call options on. So if that's the case, if this, if I'm just going with the market, right? I'm not, I'm not fighting the trend. Go with the trend. Do not fight the trend. So I'm just going with what the trend's telling me, right? You can see here, moving forward, this is what the trend is overall telling me. Uh, so we are really, really, really nice, you know. The, you know, is there a stock market crash coming? Uh, there is nothing on the charts to say that. And the people who try to call this, the people who c continue to try to call this, are the people who are going to continue to get their heads handed to them. So, you know, the thing is like, you know, there's a stock market crash coming. They're all yelling. They are all yelling stock market crash is coming. So many people are saying that still to this day. It's going to happen. It's going to happen. And it's like, guys, I'm going to do a video real soon to show you what happened in 1929. What happened in 1987. What happened in 19, uh, 2001. The tech, the tech bubble. What happened in 2008. I'm going to show you what the charts were showing me what the charts were telling you and that's when you'll be able to see whether there's going to be a serious stock market crash maybe there's going to be a four or five percent pullback in the markets soon but guess what the charts are not saying that but if there's going to be a significant pullback in the markets the markets are going to tell us that right now the markets are telling that the charts are simply saying hey we're getting ready to go up up and up again they are all calling for a stock market crash and look at this here another nice bullish update and remember i said before right and I said, look at these troughs or look at these lows. Look at this here. Low or trough, higher trough or higher low, higher trough, higher trough. Bullish up that breaking out. Who's in control of this? The buyers, right? Now, again, I was looking for a potential lower peak through here somewhere. If it was, but I was waiting for confirmation. But I said to you guys that the buyers have been in control. So don't fight that. Do not fight the market. People are trying to short this market and getting their heads headed to them. Now, I am short one stock right now. I'm not, I, I'm short one stock right now. That's because it has a massive, massive, massive head and shoulder formation. Um, and I'll tell you guys about that very, very soon. But, you know, on the weekly chart, there's, there's one stock that I'm looking at right now that I'll show you this here. So there's a, uh, let's just go here, black. So we have, we have, so pen here, we had this, had this nice run up and then a nice shoulder, nice head. And then a nice shoulder came down, gave me a really, really, really nice bear flag, and then an entry down through there. So this was the massive weekly chart saying to me, plus we got a nice bear flag, and oh, just, I just, just a bit of a setup. Anyway, we'll see what happens with that. I don't know. It may, it may stop me out. So we'll see what happens with that. Um, so I'm still in that right now. But for majority of my stocks, guys, even silver stocks, silver and gold stocks, I'm bullish on. As you guys know, I've got some, I've got a couple of stocks in silver and gold, and I've got a couple of stocks in. Uh, I've got, I've got about six or seven trades going on right now. 
But ev- but the thing is, guys, do not fight the market. It's, you know, if you're seeing this market continuing higher, pushing higher, don't fight it. Go with it. Don't you know? Do not do not be listening to these cowboys out there or what they're saying. This market is saying nothing but higher, right? Nothing but higher. And it looks like we're going to continue running higher. The one I, the one the one thing I would be worried about is the is the Nasdaq. But again, the Nasdaq, as I've been saying to you guys for a while here, look at this here, another push higher, just a push higher. Nasdaq looks like it looks like it's getting ready for the go for another run. Very very nicely smooth, bouncing off this channel, bouncing off this channel, bouncing off. Look at this here, bullish update, bouncing off the channel, breaking out, breaking out of this resistance here. And you can see this is like a bit of bit of a triangle pattern here, right? And then bam, breaks out. There is nothing bearish about that. If people are calling stock market crash, guess what? They're going to have to do another video, wink, wink, if you know what I'm talking about, saying, Meltdown, February. Oh, wait a minute. Sorry, no. Sorry, no. Wait a minute. Meltdown, March, is coming soon. <laughs> Guys, remove the bullshit of what people say. Remove the bullshit of what they what they think is going to happen. And... And just listen to the charts, right? The charts are the king and follow along with the charts. That's all I have to say is follow along with the charts because the charts are king. And that's all that matters at the end of the day, right? Just listen to the charts. And the charts are saying nothing but up, up, and up we go. So there we go, guys. A bit of a market update time on the indexes. Hey, thanks for watching. If you'd like to get more free education about trading, then click on the box that says free trading course. This is a free trading course. It goes for around 12 hours long. It's about 12 videos long. It covers everything from chart reading, mindset, trading systems, money management, trade management, everything you need to get yourself ahead in the markets. And if you'd like to get my help personally, then click on the box that says get John's help and you'll be able to see how you can get my help personally. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on the video. And remember, success can be yours if you go claim it. So step up, take massive action, and face your fears today.